Stacy Smith of Palmetto Ridge High School is teaching her students to evaluate evidence and back it up with solid reasoning. Through her best practice called deconstruction, she's equipping students with a lifelong skill, critical thinking. Now you're going to have to have evidence, so what are your opinions on it? On a scale from 1 to 10, how would you rate the story and explain? You know, every student should be able to read and write, but every student should also be able to persuade somebody in some way, whether they're going off and going to sell a product in, in the world or whether they have to convince somebody of something. My best practice is called deconstructing an argument, and what that means is students will take an argument or a study or some sort of research that they find and they deconstruct that research. The deconstruction skill is really a difficult skill to learn. So in order to make it fun and exciting, we do a lot of things like mock court cases. We do debate style. Uh, we do something that I call a deconstruction battle, which is kind of like a rap battle where the students go one-on-one -on -one against each other and they deconstruct a, a global issue. So that's really cool. She really helps with like how to make your writing better and like Definitely deconstruction like is what her practice is basically. It helps with making your writing stronger. Deconstruction is basically taking an idea and expanding it by using evidence and um, support basically. And so you have an idea and then you take evidence and then you explain the evidence and tie it all back together. Miss Smith goes above and beyond for her students. She challenges them, she pushes them to exceed what they believe is their potential. She not only helps her learn um, as a teacher, but she's also a mentor for her, which to me means the world. Um, I don't fear that my daughter comes to school and can't talk to somebody. And knowing that Miss Smith is such a great teacher, she's also a great mentor for my daughter. Addressing the challenge of today's information age, this teacher gives her students the experience and a strategy to help them analyze the validity of information from a variety of sources. She engages them with verbal deconstruction battles in a mock courtroom setting. Stacy brings a lot of things to the classroom. The class that she had my son and my daughter in is very challenging. It's Ace Global Perspectives, where they're working on their laureate research paper, which is the culmination of their senior year. And what Stacy brings to them is knowledge of how to get that work done. She's always learning the best way to do something, so she's bringing that to her kids and um, helping them really be successful and learning how to do this thing that's going to propel them into a great career in college. The laureate pre presentation that I got to do uh, during my senior year, it was a lot of hard work, a lot of long nights doing research, and you know, it was a 6,000 word paper, a 20 minute presentation, it had a lot of stages, and deconstruction was kind of just a small part of that. So having to go through that process and learning that you're capable of doing something that's so in depth um, it was a really big achievement. And then also the senior speech definitely would not have been possible without Ms. Smith. She um, tried out to do the senior speech and she wrote this lovely speech. She tried out, she did a great job, but the committee did not choose her originally to deliver the speech at graduation. She was heartbroken. So we came up with an idea of how we could persuade the committee to accept her speech and, and have her up there on the podium giving her speech at graduation. So she really fought her way up and I was by her side the entire time so that she would have this opportunity. And it is probably one of my proudest moments with one of my students. Stacy Smith is changing the way her students process information and strengthening their ability to think for themselves. This is a real life tool they will depend on for the rest of their lives. The thing that inspires me the most is to see the growth with my students. They come in with a certain set of skills and by the end of the year they leave with so many new skills and tricks up their sleeve that they can use to be successful not only in school but in the real world as well.